Here is a quick rundown of data link during flyops. To enter a network ID, go to the TAD and the NET page. Uh, set your group ID specific values for own ID and group ID. In this case, I will be number four of group 75. Now we can see members of our group represented as a purple circle on the TAD. When the TAD is set as soy, we can slew the cursor on it. You can also use the map mode option to turn the map on and off. When China Hat Forward is tapped, you can change the map to expand mode, which decentralizes the cursor on your aircraft and allows you to slew it on the map. To hook any map object, press TMS Forward for a short tap. A hooked object is represented by a dotted box on the HUD. The velocity indicator will have lines pointing at the dotted box at all times. And you can make it to your speed by holding TMS forward for one second. Just remember, as long as your object is hooked, you can make it speed. Uh, take this aircraft for an example. When the aircraft is set as speed, you can slave the TGP to it by holding China Hat forward if TGP is soy. Speed sharing on a bridge. To take a speed share, uh, slew the cursor on top of the small cake and tap TMS forward. And to make it speed, press and hold TMS forward for one second. Now you can slew Using your TGP on, on target. If you want to send your SPI to a specific member of the group, put your cursor over the member and hit the send button. On the receiving side, it will say new tasking on the TAD and you will have options for will call and can't call. If you accept by hitting will call, you will be able to see the tasking represented as a red triangle on the TAD. And that will be basics of data link. Be safe out there.